Hey guys, this is Sakib. Welcome to BD Themes widget tutorial. Today, we'll introduce you to the Stalker slider widget developed by BD Themes and a part of our Prime slider plugin. Stalker is a full width slider having a smooth transition animation for both the content and background. The slider has a thumb list as part of its navigation system. The whole thing has a minimal layout but rich in graphics and animations. From the layout section, the first scroll bar option lets you adjust the slider height as you wish. Right below, the second scroll bar is for adjusting the maximum content width for the slider widget. Try it and see the changes in real time. The alignment option is also for the content. You can use the image size option to customize the background image resolution. The query lets you change the item limit for the slider items. You can manually select the source of the slider items either to show all or go with manual selections. The additional settings section mainly has a bunch of switchers to show or hide specific items on the slider, like the title, text, excerpt, author, etc. For example, let's turn off the category button to see it disappear from the display. The last section named Slider Settings has all the animation settings for the slider. You got autoplay, loop, animation speed, etc. The navigation dots are at the bottom right here. On the Style tab, the first thing you can do is to apply a overlay color on the background. Let's adjust the transparency a bit. There are also content padding and merging options below. In the title section, let's change the color of the text to yellow. Also set hover color to white. You can change the typography of the title font here. Let's make them bigger and better. You can also place a text shadow around the title. On the next section, let's customize the text under the title in the slider. Let's pick white for the text and lower the transparency. We can also go for the typography. If you need, the next section lets you customize the meta text. Begin with changing the color to white with a less visible setting. The button is located below the meta text on the slider. On the button section, let's first change the hover color for it. Background goes yellow and texts go black. For the normal mode, let's apply a deeper color.
From the category section, let's match its background with the same color as the button. On the stalker slider, you can customize the thumb post box from the controls. Let's change the height first. Then change the color of the line animation. You can see it on the display. Then let's change the background color matching with the button but having a low transparency. Now we can move on to the title typography for the thumb posts. Next comes the arrows color for the thumb posts. Let's switch to the hover subsection and change the background color of the thumb to a matching deep color. Same goes for the arrows. Black for the background and white for the arrowhead. Again, let's switch to active subsection. Change the thumb background to the same deep and the same black and white combination for the arrows. Now your stalker slider is ready to display your posts in a unique post layout. That's all for today. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time.